I have a bad feeling about this. I don't sense anything. It's not about the mission, master. It's something elsewhere. Elusive. Obi-Wan Kenobi and Ki Gon Jin, listen, file info. In 32 BBY, by the time Jin considered Kenobi to be ready for his trials, they were sent by Galactic Republic Supreme Chancellor Finnis Valorum to negotiate with the Trade Federation, who had set up a blockade around the planet of Naboo. Both Jedi extensively studied political documents and trade relations between the parties prior to the endeavor, sensing its necessity. The two Jedi were tasked with negotiating a settlement with Trade Federation representatives. The pair traveled to the system on the Consular-class space cruiser Radiant 7 and landed on the modified Lucahulk-class LH-3210 cargo freighter Sarkak, the flagship of the blockade. There, Kenobi and Jin were brought to a conference room, where protocol droid TC-14 informed them that a Trade Federation representative would be with them shortly, and invited the pair to make themselves comfortable. However, upon learning that the pair were Jedi from TC-14, Viceroy Newt Gunray of the Trade Federation instead sent the protocol droid back into the room to distract them, with the droid offering Kenobi and Jin drinks. Gunray then ordered his security to get rid of the Jedi and their assets, with an overhead turret destroying the Radiant Seven and its crew. The two Jedi sensed the loss of their vessel and rose from their seats, drawing their lightsabers before noticing poisonous dioxus gas being pumped into the room around them and holding their breaths. OOM series security droids were then sent to confirm that the Jedi were dead. However Kenobi and Jin escaped into the hallway and destroyed the battle droids before making their way to the Sarkax bridge. Kenobi held off the battle droids while Jin attempted to cut through the doors to the bridge. However, droidikas summoned by Gunray arrived, and the two Jedi were forced to flee into a nearby ventilation shaft, using force speed to escape. The two escaped to Naboo's surface by stowing away on separate C-9979 landing crafts in the Sarkax hangar bay, discovering a droid army preparing to invade Naboo in the process. 